What up, what up, world? This is your homeboy, Wordplay TJ, and I'm back with another video for you. This time around, I'm gonna talk about a new streaming service called Audius. Stay tuned. <laughs> All right, so what is Audius? Audius is a streaming service and music community built off of the blockchain. Before I give you a brief overview of what the blockchain is, I want to talk about the creators of Audius. Audius was created by Ronil Romberg and Forrest Browning from Stanford University. The point of this platform is to decentralize the transactions between fans and musicians. So currently, the only way to get your music on Apple Music and Spotify, the big streaming services, is to use a distributor. Audius is using blockchain technology in order to bypass that, but also verify the transactions between fans and musicians. So because it's supported by the blockchain, I want to give you a quick blockchain 101 type of course. The blockchain is a decentralized ledger that is on a network of computers. And it's decentralized because no one individual owns the the sort of verification of the transactions on that ledger. So say a group of people gets together and they want to keep up with some transactions that they have, but they don't trust one person to do all of that 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 bookkeeping. So instead what everybody in this group does is they have a version of this ledger on their own system. Any transactions that are added or subtracted from the ledger have to be verified by everybody in the group before that transaction is okay. So none of these records can be changed or modified without everybody in the network doing a check on the system and making sure that that transaction is legitimate. This makes the record or the ledger more secure for everybody involved in the platform and doesn't give control to one single individual or entity over all of these transactions or the records themselves. And this is ultimately why the blockchain was developed and why people have some trust in cryptocurrencies altogether. So what we're talking about is the relationship between the musician and the music fan is one to one, it's direct. And all of those transactions from that fan to that artist are legitimized by everybody that has a copy of the ledger. What's great about Audius is that it wants to get rid of the middleman. What I don't understand at the time of this video is how Audius is going to transact or make money based off of those transactions. But what I do want is to give you a very surface level understanding of what Audius is, what the features are, and how you can go ahead and sign up, put your music up there, and also encourage fans to use Audius. So let's go ahead and talk about some of these features that I find important. So the first feature that I think is important is being able to sell premium tracks. If you've ever used a platform like Bandcamp, you can think of it this way. So not only can your fans stream your music for free and uh, hear some of your music for free, but they can also pay for your music and compensate you by using Audius. The way this is done is they use a cryptocurrency called USDC, which is a more secure and more equivalent version of the US dollar. It's a one-to-one -one comparison, which means that one USDC equals one USD dollar for us. So the way that fans would be able to get a hold of this currency is to use their dollars to purchase USDC through Stripe, which is like a PayPal equivalent, and then they can buy things from the platform. Again, the reason why this currency is important is because it decentralizes the money and the transaction is verified by all of the ledgers that are on the network. And then artists and labels can take funds that they receive from fans and then convert them back into dollars that they can use to grow their business. Another great feature I like is called audio matching. So there is this currency on the platform or reward system on the platform called an audio. And music creators get an audio whenever they interact with the platform in a way that grows the audience. So that's creating a playlist or inviting people to Audius. So this reward system is basically saying, if you invite people 
to Audius to use the platform in, in, in a way that Spotify is used or Apple Music is used, then you will get credit for bringing somebody to the platform. What's great about that is, again, artists and labels can take that reward coin and then turn it into USDC, which is the cryptocurrency, or turn it into USD, which is our dollars that we use on a day-to-day -day basis. The next feature is when transactions are available, then you can export your fans' data. Again, this is similar to platforms like Bandcamp and Patreon, but different in my opinion. The reason why it's different is because platforms like Spotify and Apple Music don't allow you to connect with your fans on a one-to-one -one basis. Audius does this different because they allow you to have the email address of your fans that make purchases from you. And also they allow your fans to direct message you and you can direct message your followers right back. In my opinion, this is combining the two greatest parts of social media and fan engagement and music listening together. What's also great about this is that this is one of the demands that we're asking for on our change.org campaign. So if you don't know, right now I am running a change.org campaign with my homeboy, Steven Everett from Chicago. Both of us are labor union leaders as well as musicians, and we both are interested and love technology. In fact, Steven is the founder of an application called Numella. The reason why we started this campaign is because we want DSPs like Spotify and Apple Music to respect music as labor. We also want them to respect the musicians that offer something to their platform so music fans can engage with Spotify and Apple Music and other DSPs. But the purpose of this campaign is to share with the DSPs that we are tired of being ignored. We're tired of not being compensated. We're tired of not having access to our fans data. We're tired of the major labels being able to have licensing agreements, but we can't make those same licensing agreements with the DSPs. And we believe that we've said this over and over again. They've changed their policies. They continue to dilute our royalties in different ways, and we're sick of it. Could you imagine watching a show, watching a movie, going to a concert without the sounds that you hear in the background? And this is why we want fans and music creators to support our Music is Labor campaign on Change.org. We believe that platforms like Audius are doing it right. And we believe the other DSPs can do it right as well. So what we're doing is asking you to sign up for our petition at change.org forward slash music labor and also get ready to boycott the DSPs on May 1st, 2025. If you'd like to support our efforts, look at the link down in the description and be sure to share it with somebody else and get ready to make some change. There's also a few more features on Audius that I want to tell you about. So the three things that I want to go over are gating music, I wanna go over remix contest, and the last one is AI attribution. So gating music is giving artists the ability to turn their music into a collectible item for fans to have a limited access to. If you haven't heard about NFTs, I made a video about that a long time ago. I'll put that up in the cards and down in the description so you can learn more about those. But basically on NFT, you can turn a project or something that is music related into a non-fungible token, an NFT, a collectible item for your fans. Fans can engage with this item by using their crypto wallet or their USDC on the platform and be owners of that particular work. What's great about this is that the blockchain will serve as the verification for their ownership and only a select few amount of fans will be able to own that work. There's also Remix Contest. So Remix Contest is giving your fans the ability to have all the stems, the instruments, the vocals, all of those tracks available to them to remix your song. Being able to hold a remix contest allows your fans to make a creation, a new creation out of the work that you already have, and then promote the song that you're trying to 
uh, push forward. AI attribution allows musicians to opt into a system that starts to learn how they make music by listening to their songs. The AI learns your voice, learns your inflections, your tone, the type of music that you create, and allows fans to create new songs out of what's modeled from your work. Once the fan creates the new song, you're able to have an attribution or what's called a credit for that new work. So I encourage you to use my link down in the description to sign up for Audius right now. Whether you are a musician or a music fan, you can sign up for Audius and use it on your Windows, Mac, or Linux computer, as well as on the iOS or Android applications. Again, you can find the link down in the description in order to try out Audius, whether you're a fan or whether you're a music creator. So that's it. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section. I appreciate you watching this video. Be sure to share this with somebody that might get something out of it and be sure to hit that like button. Be sure to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell in order to be notified when I create new videos. Until next time, it's your homeboy Wordplay TJ. Peace. And when I wake up, take me home now. Uh. Every day I'm staring at the phone now. Yeah. Okay. Three months gone, hanging on messages. And only adults know what the.